guys and welcome to Tikara Presents. If it's your first time here, welcome, welcome. If you've been here before, welcome back. Listen, I'm gonna blow y'all minds and y'all taste buds with this one. Sweet chili chicken meatballs. If you wanna see how we make them, just stick around. All right, so here are the ingredients we are going to need. We have two pounds of ground chicken, chicken seasoning by Mrs. Dash, kicking chicken seasoning from Weber, onion powder, garlic powder, black pepper and salt, and of course we have our sweet chili sauce. If you don't have the kick and chicken seasoning, don't worry, you can just sub in uh, red pepper flakes for a little bit of heat. So you're gonna go ahead and get your meat seasoned. Remember not to overwork your ground chicken because it will get tough on you and you don't want that. So just kind of break it up a bit with your fork, layer in your seasonings, and then we're gonna go ahead and form our meatballs. All right, so we have, make sure you heat your oil up. I have a little bit of vegetable oil in the pan. You can use canola oil if you like, but I would not recommend using olive oil. Um, so get your, your oil up to temp, and then you're going to cook your meatballs. So we're gonna get them all in the pan. Make sure you have a little bit spacing between them so they don't overcrowd the pan or boil. So you're gonna make sure that you cook them evenly. You're gonna have to move them around a little bit to make sure that they get browned on all sides. Um, it, it'll take a little bit and it'll take a little bit to kind of make sure you're moving around your pan to keep the oil distributed evenly. And uh, once they are done, you wanna make sure that they are fully cooked through. You can try to break one with a fork if that's the case, but it's ground chicken so it doesn't take that long to cook. Um, once they're completely done, we're gonna go ahead and add in our sauce and then we'll be done. Okay, so this is what they look like when they are done. I'm still just kind of moving them around. They are delicious, just like this. But when you add the sauce to this, it's going to take it to a whole nother level. So listen, if you're not sure how to make sure that your meatballs are done, the meat is going to firm up. So your balls are going to be firm when they're completely cooked. If you're not sure, take your fork, break it in half, make sure there's no pink left, and then go ahead and add your sauce and prepare to have the time of your life. <laughs> it's really, really good. Like this is one of the, this is a, it's, it's a fantastic recipe. So it's a must try and I am just excited to share with you guys and I hope you enjoy. So here we're gonna go ahead and add in our sauce. Um, I use probably three quarters of the container uh, because I use two pounds of the ground chicken. Um, if you're going to half the recipe, obviously you won't need to use so much. Um, but go ahead, get your sauce in there. And then you're going to go ahead, get each ball covered, each meatball covered in the sauce. So stir it around. And then we're going to go ahead and cover it just a little bit to make sure that we are allowing the sauce to get thick and cover. Uh, you want the meatballs to be nice and coated completely. Once that's all set, serve them up with some potatoes or some white rice or some noodles and enjoy if you like this recipe please give this video a thumbs up come back and check back for more videos um thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe to the channel and i will see you all again next time take care